Buenos dias, you know, back in Cali. Woke up this morning, you know, did the the usual stuff. Woke up, checked my messages, went on YouTube, and I went on this channel called uh, 24, the 24-7 Scoop. It's a channel that basically, you know, puts all the Chicano rappers out there, you know, who's saying what about who and what's going on. That's pretty cool. I don't really see them doing no hating shit. But the comments, though, and I already know where all these hating-ass comments are coming from, man. You know, it's starting to fucking get annoying, though, because they be getting at me on DMs and saying dumb shit. I already know what some of you are going to say. Black, you don't pay attention to it. Do what you do. I'm like, oh, you're doing so good. But this is how I'm going to do it this morning, man. Any of you bitch-ass rappers, any of you bitch-ass motherfuckers that be saying some hating-ass shit on me, where you want it, man? I'm just ready to fuck someone up. I feel like fucking someone up. Let me know, homie. You really with it? Where you at? I'll go to you. Hello? Blackie? Yeah. What's up, homie? This is Scoop. Oh, what's up, my boy? I'm just chilling, man. Chilling. Just got off of work, you know. You want to top it up? Yeah, my boy. Uh, what you want to know, call you, man? Yeah, no problem, man. Uh, okay. I, ain't, I ain't got no problem contacting nobody, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, no, and I'm, and I'm glad you did, man. I'm glad to hear yeah, that. Yeah, like I said, I, I, I contacted Capone and them as well, and they started telling me all kinds of shit, talking about lawyers and this and that. They had the biggest lawyers with money. I told them I didn't really, I didn't really care, you know what I mean? I wasn't doing anything. Yeah. So it is what it is. Yeah, you. I mean, I mean, you could tell, you know, that this fake ass mother. Hello. Fake motherfuckers in this little, small little racket we call Chicano rap, and yeah. and it's hard, it, and it's hard to associate. It's hard to see who are the real ones and who are the fake ones. So that's why I wanted to have an opportunity to talk to you in person. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got no beef with you with what you do. You know what I'm saying? If anything, I think it's great what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? Not a lot of people do do what you're doing as far as, you know, taking the time to, you know, follow the characters in this rap game and and putting them out there on the internet for... Because there's a lot of people that want to see this shit. There's a lot of people that really want to get to know these people, want to really get to know what's, what's going on. And for the most part, a lot of the rappers like Mr. Capone and a lot of these fools, they don't want that to happen because they don't want him to be exposed. Happen, <laughs> exactly. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And yeah, and yeah. Uh, and I'm glad that I had an opportunity to talk to you. You know, yeah. I woke up this morning and I saw one of the uh, uh, the ones you posted when I was in South Central in the music video with uh, the Threshold Boys, and yeah. I was just reading all, all the comments and. It's just like, and it's just like, it's, you know, There's a lot of shit talkers. People, a lot of shit talkers. Yeah, a lot of shit talking, and a lot of those shit talkers, they get at me on my DMs mm-hmm. and and fucking, you know, talk shit. And and you know the thing. Is... Hello. Hey. Hello. This is my ex bitch. I know how they get hey, down. Hey, my bad, like, man. I'm not, I'm not I, getting real good signal out here. Uh, you just cut off for like about 10 seconds. Oh, okay. Yeah. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Yeah, no, I, I was just saying, like, I know these people. I know I, I know the, the, the ones that are talking shit mm-hmm. on, your, on your channel mm-hmm. are Miss Lady Pink behind a fake page, are Mr. Capone behind a fake page, and are their little minions that they that they you know, rally up and, and tell them, hey, go over here and talk shit because I've been in their organization. Damn. I know how they get down. I mean, you know what I'm I mean, saying? So it's just... he, he might be fake this and that, but I'll give it to him. He's a smart motherfucker. You know what I mean? He, 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 knows, how to make, he knows how to make money. Let me tell you something. It's easy for a guy like him to make money when you have already jumped in the game with a budget. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what? Exactly, game, exactly. Uh, you know, yeah, he probably had mom and dad money and he jumped in and that's what he used to promote and shit. That's what, I mean, anybody anybody can do that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yep. If you already have the money, if you already have the budget, shit. That's what I tell motherfuckers all day. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, Blackie, I want to get signed to your label. How can I do it? It's like, man, this is hustle, homie. You're going to have to show me 
that you want to hustle. Well, how can we do it? Homie, you got $20,000. What I did in five years, come with a budget, come with a $20,000 budget. And what I did in five years, I, I can make it happen for you in six months, homie. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And you'll get your fucking money back. Exactly. You know? Exactly. And, and, and I, I've, I, I've had conversations with Capone. And you know what? You, you, you want to call him smart. At one time, I even told Capone to his face, I, you know, I respect your hustle. Mm -hmm. I respect the hustle that you do. That's you it. know, and that's when, <laughs> and that's all that I, at the time, that's the only respect that I had for him. Because I knew, that, I already knew that he's a fake bitch ass motherfucker you know what i'm saying exactly. but in this game there's a difference between the streets and the industry the two cannot coexist nah. they cannot you know what i'm saying yeah so, I, I get what you mean i get what you mean he's he's, he's putting out there a whole you know, he's representing the whole gang culture and um you know and, and him not really being about that culture is is you know you know what i mean yeah well, yeah, it's awful games. I mean, all, all the successful fucking rappers in this game are fake motherfuckers. Just pretending to be something that they're not. You yeah, know what yeah, I'm yeah. saying? And and when a motherfucker like me, a real motherfucker, is trying to emerge and he's and he's hustling and he's doing his thing, it's motherfuckers like this that keep them down. They they, they, they want to keep them, you know, don't nobody want to see nobody doing better than them. Exactly. Especially a motherfucker that knows their secrets. You know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> they're going to get exposed sooner or later. And that's what I'm trying to do, doggy. And you know, uh, I'm glad I got to uh, uh, talk to you. And and yeah, if you are, I, I've been having people hitting me up talking about, oh, I want to do an interview with you. And I'm like, yeah, let's do it. And then right when we start the process of promoting that we're gonna do something, mm -hmm. all of a sudden they jump ship on me. Why? Because these motherfucking internet celebrities get at them and tell them, if you fuck with Blackie Fontana, then we're not fucking with you. It's already been done. Uh, yeah, see, I would, I wouldn't, Brown I wouldn't, boys. I wouldn't do nothing like that because that's you're being a fucking hypocrite doing something like that. There's a lot of fucking hypocrites in this game. There's a lot of hypocrites in this world, my boy. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But see, so you, that's what you know. What I'm saying you, you're you're offering me an interview, but to tell you the truth, I wouldn't know where to start. I wouldn't know what to that's ask. If you're you. interested. You know, you know, I, mean? I I I just see, I see what you're doing. I just see what you're doing as far as, you know, just checking out uh, 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 the, the, these artists' this page, seeing what they're doing and whatever catches your eye, whatever you feel the public is going to like, you put it out there. Yeah. And, you know, and you're just keeping it going. And I, I think that's great. And, and it's a platform that you're already starting. You know what well, I'm saying? Shit, and the, if you do. The reason I started this was because, uh, you know, I'm a big Brownside fan, a toker. And, um, I remember I saw one of his live videos and I just saw only about a hundred people saw that shit. So I recorded it and then I said, I'm going to upload it to YouTube. So the re I'm sure there's a lot of fans like me that want to see all his live feeds. Right. And that was, that was how my first of video, course. that was how my first video happened. And his, his video got like 30 K views in like a month, I think. And, um, I just, yeah, I just said, fuck, yep. I'm going to roll with it and I'm going to start, you know, I'm gonna start recording everybody else. See, see, you know, see, see what give the fans what they want. Cause I'm sure everybody wants to see all that. If only a hundred people get to see it, you know, whenever they're live, you know what I mean? Of course. Yeah. Well, the you honestly, my boy, Chicano rap doesn't have TMZ. They don't have Hip Hop Weekly. They don't have Double XL Magazine. None of that. They don't have none of this. Shit. I know. I know all and, that and, shit too. And 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 the YouTube is is where you can start a TMZ channel for for these. That's why YouTube is very important. You know that that's your channel. That's where people go to to see what your music videos, what's going on, whatever you want to put out there. If they're not following you on Facebook, on Instagram, on Snapchat, go on fucking YouTube, and everybody's talking about you there. Damn, you know anything that you're associated with. You know, you just, you know, the 24, the 24 seven school, Blackie Fontana, anybody that subscribes to my channel, once you put my name, that's going to pop up on their feed and they're going to be like, Oh, what's this? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Let Definitely. me check this out. And I didn't think, I've, and, I've and heard I've been getting a lot of buzz out there in, in California and I'm not, you know what I'm saying? I'm not even out there. I'm out here in Texas. 
See what I'm saying? And and I don't know if you ever heard of that fool Spliff TV. Is he, yeah, he lives. Uh, yeah. I think he lives down here in Katy, right, right south of Houston. Yeah, and he's the same way. He's doing a little bit more, like as far as like yeah, interviews does, and all he that. Does, he does reactions and all of that. Yeah, I seen. I seen his. Yeah, yeah. And, and and you see what he's doing. He's trying to get the West Coast. Yeah, cause uh, he, no, cause cause he knows he saw that. That's where a, a lot of people. That's what a lot of people want to see. That ain't on the internet. It's Chicano rap crime. Exactly. Every, every Chicano rap, all the fans are on the internet, and that's why I feel like what you're doing is dope. You know, you're 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 starting something. It's like you know, you 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 just you you just made a baby right now. And you're watching it take its first step. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And yeah, you're right now. You're doing uh, these uh, just posting videos and for people to see. That's how it starts. Well, to be then honest, I don't, I, don't, I don't really even have time to be uh, out here recording everybody's, man. But you know how the phone alerts you whenever somebody gets on live that's, that you're following? Um, usually when that happens, if I'm busy, I'll just open the video and press record and I'll leave the phone alone and I'll walk away and do what I got to yeah. do. Well, yeah, you know, fucking... Well, you know, like like I said, I just I, I see what you're doing and, and when I never saw it as disrespectful... I never, you know, I just seen it like this guy's. It seems like this guy's trying to help out the game. You know what I'm saying? Cool, cool, cool. Give the game another, another avenue, another way of, of promotion. And I just wanted to see if you really were a real person. You are. Nah, you I am. Probably. I mean, and also and, every artist that I upload, you know what I mean? If they don't, if they don't like the shit I upload of them, if they come at me themselves, you know, and ask me with some respect to take it off, I'll take it off. You know, just because they're coming at me with respect. But if they're going to come at me like a pony did, I ain't going to take shit off. Because yeah. I, had, I had I had another artist that I uploaded his live feed, and he was, he, he had a gun on there. Um, and I uploaded his shit, and he sent me a, a DM saying, hey, can you please take that video of me off? And I said, hey, no problem. I'll take it off right now. It lasted about a day. And... You know, we, I mean, I, I, I hear you're busy. This is probably just like a little hobby of yours. And yeah, yeah, it's just it's a hobby, like, man. It's, it's a hobby. I run I run yeah. two businesses, brother. I, I've been self-employed for a long time. This is just, you know, it's just, it's just a little hobby that I came up with when I was bored one day. And and look at all the attention that you're getting exactly, out of it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> A lot. Look at all the attention you're getting I, I was, out of that. I wasn't even expecting it. To tell you the truth, I was just going to upload all of, all of uh, Toker's live feeds and shit so his fans could see it. Yeah, and then, you know, it popped off from there. Toker popped it off with the phone, Criminal. Everybody, and yeah. Started, started popping off on and everybody, yeah. And then I put in my two cents and people started talking about me and you're doing that. And you're just giving what the people want. Yeah, yeah, they could criticize, you know, like, they could like it, or they could hate it. You know, that, that's them. I ain't, I ain't tripping. Exactly. And that, and I think that's dope. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, you know, uh, I just want to talk to you. I'm glad you gave me an opportunity to talk. And if you are interested in, in doing a, a interview or something, I, like, I'm down. You know what I'm saying? Like, because you're already, people are already knowing your channel. You know okay. what I'm saying? And this will give it that extra, that extra little push. You know, like, oh, shit. Like, yeah, this is where I'm going to go to this. Definitely. Yeah, you know, hey, well, um, this, is, this, this is this is my my work number as well. So I have to. Uh, it, it's set up to record every single call I make. So uh, so just in case I need to write down an address and I can't when I'm driving, I just go back and listen to it. So I don't know if you if you care, you know, like if you want, I could upload this to to my channel and ask them, you know, what would you like me to ask Blackie Fontana on his interview, and then we could go from there. But if you don't want me to upload the yeah. call, we could keep it just between us. And, you know, I won't upload it. Yeah, I mean, go ahead, dog. Like, me in this game, dog, I have nothing to hide, homie. Exactly. I that, that's what I noticed about you. I noticed, I noticed that you're, you know, you're a real motherfucker. Anybody says shit, you, you tell them straight up, you know what, let's meet up. Let's meet up. Nothing like, you're not just out here, you know, talking shit. You, you, you're over here telling them, let's meet up. Let's, it's going to be what it's going to be. That's exactly, what, yeah, you know what, what I'm saying. But, but, my, my, I mean, my artist name is Blackie Fontana. You know, I, I'm trying to be a rapper, homie. I'm trying to be yeah. a rapper, and and I, yeah, I'm trying to be successful in this game. But when I'm in when I'm in California, dog, when I'm back in my area, when I'm back in my hood, I'm Blackie from South Fontana, THL. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. And, and that's, you're not the artist I, that's no more. <laughs> 
Yeah, that's, that's, that's what my pride is at. You know what I'm saying? My name on the streets, my name in the pen, my name with the homies. You know what I'm saying? That's what my pride is. And, and that's why I have no shame. I, I, don't, I don't feel like I got to hide or, or watch what I say in this rap game. I don't have to watch what I say on the Internet. Exactly. Because what you see is what you get, homie. You know, my music, my, you want to get to know me? Get to know, get listen to my music. I don't fucking lie. Every every fucking verse in my music is me introducing myself to you. So as far as as far as this conversation, yeah, shit, uh, put it on the channel. Let, uh, uh, let let the people talk. You know what I'm saying? Let them know, like, hey, you know, talk to Blackie Fontana, chop it up real good. What do you guys think? What do you guys do? You guys want exactly. a, a black people on the and interview? And a lot of artists nope. don't understand that publicity, whether it's good or bad, is still publicity. You're still in somebody's mouth. That's because motherfucking artists are afraid of what people think about them. I can give a fuck exactly. what people got to say about me, homie, on the internet. People that don't know who the fuck I am. Motherfuckers in my own hood don't even fucking like me. Motherfuckers that I grew up with, motherfuckers that know who I am, don't like me. Why? Because they hate him. Hey, but you're, 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 not... getting, you're getting a pretty good fan base because I noticed that your videos are some of the ones that people react to the most and, and you get you get like 1K views overnight. Hey, no, and you know what? And I appreciate... I, and I do see that. Yeah, I do see that. I do I, I do see that I'm getting a little bit more attention. Uh, uh, even though a good majority of the attention I'm getting is negative, is coming from my haters, but... You know the the little fans that I do have, the, the the real supporters that I do have, I appreciate them the most. When I go on tour and I catch up with people that know who I am, come to my bus and want to pick up my album, and for the most part, the ones that don't know who I am but actually give me a shot because they actually do listen to Chicano rap, they respect Chicano rap music. You know, they listen to Little Rob, they listen to Capone, they listen to Criminal, they exactly. listen to King Lil G. Well, who the fuck are you? I don't know who the fuck you are. Well, I'm Blackie Fontana. That's why I'm right here in the streets. I'm here to introduce myself to you. Well, All right? Well, the, way, the, way, the way I see it, if somebody's talking bad about you and the other person doesn't even know who you are, they're going to be like, well, who the fuck is this guy? They're going to go check you out and then they're going to have their own opinion about you. They might say, nah, exactly. nah, nah, he's dope. Exactly. I think he's dope. So... Exactly, you know, and that's and that's what this game that's what this game has always been based on, you know, just having people talk about you. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Having people talk about you, and if you if you a real motherfucker, real motherfuckers gonna fuck with you. Exactly. If you a real motherfucker, fake ass motherfuckers is gonna talk shit about you. Yeah, you know exactly. what I'm saying? Hell yeah, and exactly. fucking, and, and that's just what I'm here. I'm here. I, I, I'm already. I, I like I said. I'm already glad that I'm in the game. Yeah. I'm glad that I'm I'm in the game now. I'm in the Chicano rap game. Not a lot of motherfuckers know me, but a good amount of motherfuckers do know me. You know what I'm saying? And it's just building from there. Homie, I got more projects. I got more music videos to drop. I'm connecting with, I believe, our real motherfuckers. You know, I, I pushed the issue when I did that music video in South Central. I wanted to catch up with Brownside. I wanted to have an opportunity to talk to Toker, and I did. And, and I'm glad of that. I, I got to meet... The Trece Boys, Stravi, and Danger, and, the, and in my opinion, those are real motherfuckers right there. Mm -hmm. And that's what I want. I want to connect with real motherfuckers. And, I, and I've and i met this about, I know Capone, bitch-ass motherfucker. I know Criminal. I met Little Rob. I I, I met uh, uh, King Little G. I know all these fucking cats, dog. I know them. I know the people they fuck with, you know, and, and I'm, I don't really fuck with a lot of these motherfuckers, dog. I really don't because, like I said, I want to fuck with real motherfuckers in the game, real sureños. You know what I'm saying? Exactly, exactly. And for the most part, a lot of these fools ain't fucking sureños, dog. You know what I'm saying? So they, that's why I, mean, I move forward for the money. by myself. What happened? They doing it for the money. Oh, well, I mean, me too. I mean, I wouldn't be in this game if it wasn't because for the money. I mean, honestly... I'm and I'm I, there's not everybody in Chicano rap is fucking making big time money, dog. Yeah. Capone's making money because, like I said, that puto he already came in the game with a budget. Yeah. You know he already came in. This motherfucker been having fucking money. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, and fucking he's the only he's one of the millionaires. The only motherfucker in this game that is a millionaire and I respect is Empty Magic. 
Mm-hmm. MC Magic, dog. That that's another motherfucker that that's in this game. I I don't know too much of his story, but what I do know is that he has hustle. He every time I see him work, it's like it's like no matter how big his name is, he still hustles. Like his name is equivalent to my name. You know what I'm saying? Like he has to be there early. He has to be the first one in the door, and he has to be the last one out the door. Definitely. You know what I'm, what I'm saying? Not 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 like all these other fucking rappers that just do it for the fucking fame. You know what I'm saying? And they're scared to hit the streets. They're scared to post up in their booth because they feel like, oh, someone's gonna come over here and bitch slap me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, definitely. And definitely. and they, and I'm tr- I'm trying to reach that level in the game where hell yeah, I want to be a millionaire in this shit, dog. But it ain't easy, homie. It ain't fucking easy for a motherfucker that's really from the bottom. Yeah, you know? Hey, hey but it, but. You know, sometimes it ain't even, you got, you got to have a couple of hustles. No doubt, you know no doubt. I mean, I mean you, can't just, there, you got to have a couple of hustles, man. Um, I'm, not saying, I'm, not saying, I'm not saying I'm a millionaire, you know what I mean? But, it, you know, I'm good, I'm good. But I, I got a couple of hustles, a couple of different things I do. Yeah, no doubt. I mean, you can't be in this game and just be a rapper. You know, there's a lot of, more, they, you know, own businesses. You know, you, you're doing something on the side. You're not just. Even Capone's at. He's not he, he's not all making money off of his music. That fool's a fucking used car salesman, dog. That's what he he sells cars. He sells he sells uh, I know this fucker. I know what he and, and he has his little family money, dog. His parents still be giving him fucking money, dog. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. Like you know, like everybody like, hell yeah, I'm trying to get my hustle on in this game. Like I ain't try, I can't get no job. You know, I can't go back to my old hustle pushing dope. Yeah, what, what, yeah you, that gonna gotta, get? you gotta find That's, a legal hustle, man. There's, there's plenty of, of of legal, legit hustles out there that can make a lot of money. Hell yeah, and I'm just glad that I'm in a position in life where I don't have kids. I, all, all my only responsibility in life is myself. All yeah. I gotta take care of is myself, so I can't do these tours and invest in my own tour bus, invest in my own music, go state to state, hit the streets, and and you know. Every CD sold, every dollar made, it's all going to me. You know what I'm saying? And fucking, I'm glad that I'm making money off my music. If it wasn't for the fact that I have to fucking give, I didn't have to, but I mean, my mom's needed fucking money for a lawyer. I have five racks, and I mean, to to most motherfuckers, five racks ain't nothing. Hey, man. Go, but to me, family first. Family you family know, first. five racks, and I was like, you know, five racks was a big budget music video that was sure to fucking get motherfuckers talking and invest back in this game so I can make more money. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. But I gave that to moms, man. Mom needs it, and I, I'm a, she helped me out. I'm going to help her out. And and that put me back to square one where I'm like, fuck, I can't stop hustling. Right now, in these months, October, November, December, is when a motherfucker's supposed to relax and plot on the next tour. I'm still hustling, my boy. Shit, gotta, gotta keep it up, man. Gotta keep it up. Yeah, always, doggy, always. But yeah, I, I, I mean, if you're recording this, do yeah. what you want with it. I ain't, I ain't even, you know, like I said, I ain't hate on your program. I appreciate you getting at me after basically calling you out on social media and giving me a fucking call. Dog. Hey, to like tell I you said, the I truth, just, I didn't uh, even know. I didn't, I didn't even know. But I got a, I got a notification. Some dude posted on a video, one of my videos on YouTube. Um, saying that you were calling me out, and uh, I was like, "Well, shit, I'm gonna go check it out, and I'm gonna go ahead and send him a DM and see see what it's about." You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, and I'm glad yeah. I'm glad we had an opportunity to chop it up, get to know each other, my boy. And yeah, you know what I'm saying? If this is a hobby for you, cool. You know, I mean, that's dope. If it's a hobby, look how much success you're getting out of it. You know what I'm saying? And uh, if you take it even further, like, let me know, dog. Uh, uh you know, I, I fucks with you, dog. Definitely. All yeah. right, brother. Shit. Um, we was good chopping it up with you, man. I'll let you know. Uh...